So the first thing that we want to do is distribute the 3 fifths to both terms in the parentheses. So we'll have y over 2 plus 3y over 5 minus 21 over 5 is less than or equal to 6. We can get rid of both denominators by just multiplying the inequality by their product, which is 10. Um, so this way we have 10 times y over 2 plus 3y over 5 minus 21 over 5 is less than or equal to 10 times 6. On multiplying this, we can just cross cancel as we go along. So the denominator 2, that'll go into 10 5 times, so we really have 5 times y. So we'll just have 5y plus, same thing for the 3y over 5. 5 goes into 10 twice, so that 5 cancels and we really have 2 times 3y, which is 6y minus, and then same thing here, 2 times 21, negative 21, which will get us negative 42, is less than or equal to 60. Now we can just combine the like terms, so we have 11y minus 42 is less than or equal to 60, and we can add both sides um, by 42, so that 11y is alone. Once those cancel, we have 11y is less than or equal to 102. And then we can divide both sides by 11 so that y is alone. And that leaves us with y is less than or equal to 102 over 11. So graphing this, we'll plot 102 over 11. And since y is equal to it, in addition to being less than it, we have to fill in that solid bubble. And since it's also less than, we shade to the left because those would include all the numbers on the number line smaller than that. So then the interval notation, since it'll be going on forever with every number less than 102 over 11, it'll be negative infinity to 102 over 11 completed with the bracket since it also includes 102 over 11.